for years, I had an irrational hatred for horses. And I don't know what it was about horses. I just couldn't stand them. Yeah. <laughs> horses. You know? Good. And until I got a dog, I hated dogs too, but it was because I got bit by a dog. And, uh, and I understand your hatred for wasps. I've been stung. I, if I were to count every time I've been stung by a wasp, it's easily in the hundreds of times. Wow. You know, like, Why is that? Like when we were, well, f- the first time was, I mean, other than being stung when you're a kid outside, like, you know, growing up in the country, you, you encounter bees and wasps, you know, it happens. But um, my parents, when I was a kid, um, in our house, we, you know, like you have a fuse panel, you know, where you, you have uh-huh. all the fuses and breakers for your for electrical system in your house. Well, the wasps burrowed in between the foundation and the conduit for the wiring to Ooh. our fuse panel. And mm. they built a nest in behind the wall in our basement. And we had like an infested wall of wasps that we didn't even know about until they just entered the house. So this one night, all of a sudden, our the room in our basement where we watched TV and hung out as a family um, was full of wasps one night. Like we were in the dark watching a movie and we're covered oh in wasps. Like my parents, oh my they're crawling up our god. arms and stuff. <laughs> oh yeah. my god. And, and that that infestation came back at least two more times. Oh, so we had that, whiz. you know, and then, and then I was also a roofer. Um, you know, in college, I used to work, you know, fix, replace shingles on roofs. Uh-huh. And one time we were opening, opening, a, we were opening a soffit one time and there was a wasp nest behind there and I was on a ladder and I got swarmed by a nest of wasps Ooh. and I couldn't do anything about it oh other than just climb down the ladder. I'm 20, 20 feet in the air. I'm getting stung all over my body. You know? Oh no. <laughs> and, oh God. And you know, you know how like different parts of your bodies emit pheromones, right? Like, so like we have like pheromone glands behind our ears. And it's probably the strongest for pheromones that come out of our bodies is from behind our ears. Um, for whatever reason, I get stung there a lot. Like I'd be out golfing and it's in the middle of a field and a wasp has come along and go, bam, sting me in the ear and just take off. And I remember I used to get sting, stung behind the ear like on a weekly basis for a couple year period before it stopped happening. Christ. So so I get... The little bastards, aren't they? The wasps. The oh. little, little bastards. Just fuck off wasps. Exactly. I hate them. Me too. <laughs> God. So, yeah. The world would be better without wasps, I think. Seems that way. Like, I I can handle bees. Yeah, bees. I, I've been stung by a bee, but it was, I could understand why. It was my fault. I abused the bee. The bee stung me. Nope, not a problem. But wasps, they're just after you. They, they just they just have something to prove. I don't know what it is. Especially at this time of year here, they're just on their last legs and they, they, they will go for you. You know, you can see them eyeing you up and they're like, oh, let's, uh, I'll go out in a blaze of glory here. No, not with me. Thanks very much. I hate them.